Hey love, so it's your girl April and this video is by Best Lace Wigs or it's by me but I am featuring a Best Lace Wigs unit in it. So this is their Glueless Full Lace Wig GSW146 in the color 1B, 22 inches. So first of all, I went ahead and washed the unit because it came packaged, it was a little stiff, the curls were a little tight, a little frizzy, so I decided to wash it. Um, it does come in, I think these are one of their newer boxes, which is a little bit more sturdier. And it does have their signature brush inside, as well as your return slip if you don't like the product, and a stocking cap. When I washed it, I did use certain products. I used the Optimum Alma Legend Conditioner, which is really good. The stuff smells so good. Um, and this is damage repair. It doesn't necessar necessarily have to be damaged, but this is the one that I grabbed. And once I rinsed the conditioner out and allowed it to dry, um, but prior to it drying, once I rinsed the conditioner out, I did brush it thoroughly, and I used some of my Cantu um, Coconut Curling Cream in it, meaning the curls were more defined, they were a lot looser, and they looked a lot more natural. So the only thing that I had to do with this unit actually is tweeze a little bit in the parting area, and that was because because I um, required or requested rather the most density so I got the unit that had the most density the thickest density because I love a lot of hair so in the unit it does have the combs in the front area right by the temple and this is all the lace right here so more or less this is a lace front so you will see the tracks on the outside if you lift it up if you don't lift it up, you're not going to see the tracks. So you cannot part anywhere. You can only part right here in this area. Along with that, there's a comb and an adjustable strap in the nape area as well. So I went ahead and made a part already. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place some of my concealer, which is by Beauty Treats, which I've been using uh, a lot in my videos. I'm going to place that on the part. Uh, and that is going to be the first concealer that I'm going to place in the part. Okay, ladies, so here we go. You already know the gist. I'm going to go ahead and place this unit on my head and get her situated. I did part her more to the left, so that is where I do like most of my parts. But this is a lace front, and she does fit very snug, depending on where you put the latches in the adjustable strap in the back. I'm going to go ahead and pull a little bit of my hair out in the front, just to make the hairline look a lot more natural. So the wig is very dense, so the first thing I'm going to use is my Topic Carotene Hair Filler Fibers. And then I'm also going to be placing the ELF Cover All Cover Stick Concealer on the unit this is the second concealer that I use and the reason for that is because the first concealer is a little bit light so I like to lighten the lace of the actual wig and then I'll go ahead over top with the actual elf the hair glaze that I'm using is by Even New York, which I absolutely love, and it is one of the best hair glaze tamers, edge tamers on the market. Now, what I'm going to do is just fluff the hair out with my fingers. I prefer to do this with my fingers opposed to with an actual comb. This just gives it a more natural and realistic look opposed to it being frizzy. A little bit of the hair did shed as I was finger combing it, but nothing major as you can see. Okay, so first of all, let's start with this is some beautiful, gorgeous hair. Very soft. I think a lot of it had to do with the products that I use. I only use products like this when it's curly. If it's straight, then I'm going to put something different in it, of course. But it will either be the OGX um, Coconut Quenching Curl or this one by... Um, Cantu, which is their coconut curling cream, and also I sometimes use Miss Jessie's products or Cream of Nature. But either way, I always do this when the hair is damp, and I just let the curls define themselves. It keeps their hair from becoming or uh, frizzy, crazy big, n nappy, or tangly. It just keeps the hair so soft, and it also keeps the hair from drying out as well. So it is always looking like moisturized and things like that. But this lace front wig is like beautiful so i have worked with best lace wigs many many times prior to this channel and to me they always have like some really great units the density of them is really great but you can always customize your unit as it is you guys know i love a lot of hair big hair especially when it's curly i do like it to be really big because if you're gonna do a wig 
go big. That's all there is to it. Or go home, either way. But with hair like this, when there's a lot of it, you can do many different things, many different styles. Me, for one, I do like to put the cornrows in it. But we've already seen that. So, of course, I'm not going to show you that. But because it's so big and full, the one thing that I do like is, for one, you can always pull it back. Now, you will need to make sure that you have hair pulls out on the perimeter so I don't really right now but I'm going to show you guys anyway so the first hairstyle that I'm going to show you is something just basically something super easy if you have any type of clips you can do this pin up hairstyle just make sure that you leave out some hairs on the sides and front as well as in the nape area depending on how far you're going to have your updo but this is really easy and it's something just something cool especially during the heat months and you can do a lot of different styling options with big hair I love this hair because it's lightweight the cap is super easy and lightweight as well so this makes the styling options really easy and as you can see all I did was just brush it down just a little bit up over my hairline because I didn't actually pull out a lot of hair of my own so just to cover it or camouflage my actual hairline I went ahead and brushed some of the hairs down as well but something poofy it's really cute especially if you're working out you can do something like this really fun the next one here, as you can see, I'm going to go ahead and just pull the hair back once again. I think this one is one of my favorite opposed to me wearing cornrows. So I'm just going to take a elastic band and I'm just going to sweep that hair on the side and put it in a side ponytail. You can also put it in a middle ponytail as well, depending on your preference. Okay, and so this is my next hairstyle for this big thick hair. I like it in a ponytail. You can either put it directly in the middle in a low ponytail so that way it can just be poofy in the back area or you can put it more towards either the left or right and kind of like throw her over the shoulder a little bit front and back. That way you have some in the front and some in the back. This is great for when it gets really hot, which it's about to get right out here in Arizona. So I do like to keep a lot of the hair off of my face, or off of my neck, but I still like to wear it. So this is one of the styles that I would do opposed to the cornrows or the clip hair up, just to stay cool. So for the most part with this unit, I really do like this one. Now you girls know I love big hair, big curly hair. First of all, I was never a huge fan of curly hair until like probably like a year ago because I found, like I said, certain products that really work well with it. So that's when I became like the humongous fan of curly hair. But this one right here, I do favor this density a lot. Plus the hair is super soft and it's a lace front. It's a little bit different than me making a wig on one of those dome mesh caps because in the summertime it gets really high here. So I try to allow my head to breathe a lot. But other than that, um, Best Lace Wigs, they got some banging hair. Um, one of my favorite wigs, which I made, was the Kinky Straight, and I wear that all the time. You girls see me in that in my Real Talk videos. On, like, a lot of my videos, I have that wig on because I favor that hair a lot, and it's been doing me justice. So that is one of my favorite units. Um, you can check out their weaving department on their website. I would highly suggest the um, Kinky Straight. Or you can check out this. There is a $10 off code, which is April 10. And I'll post that for you girls below. As well as that, let me know what you think of this unit from Best Lace Wigs. Is there, there are so many different styling options to this unit. So you're not stuck with one. You can basically part it anywhere except for all the way through. Because like I said, it is a lace front. But it's so thick. And the density is just so just juicy that is the best way that i can describe it because i like a lot of hair it's just a really really beautiful unit and it's 22 inches and this is the gsw 146 in a color 1b so all the info will be posted for you girls below let me know what you think of this one right here make sure you rate comment subscribe thumb this video up and i'll see you ladies on my next video